The word of God also has similar characteristics to truth. Any child of God, any Christian who wants to grow in truth, wants to become strong in truth, no. Any child of God who wants to be strengthened and be encouraged in this in this um, position they've taken to represent the truth and dish out truth so that other people can be saved, can be delivered, you can't do it without the Word of God. Because truth bears the same characteristics as the Word of God, which is a double-edged sword, you know, that separates um, properly. Now, now that we're talking about truth, one of the things that is very important is to be an agent and be a carrier of truth, you need the Holy Spirit because the Holy Spirit is truth. Listen, a human being is a vessel, it's a container, it's like a water bottle. Whatever you allow this bottle to be filled with, you have to allow whatever the bottle is filled with, filled with you have to allow it. If you want water to be filled with it, you have to allow it. If you want alcohol to be filled with filled, uh, or to be poured into the bottle, you have to allow it. It's very important. Now, whatever happens, every human being is going to be filled with the Spirit. So if you are stopping and if you are blocking the Holy Spirit from filling you, some another Spirit will take the place of a Holy Spirit, which is not, which will not be the Holy Spirit. A lot of, you see, a lot of believers are doing things to block the Holy Spirit from taking total control. He knows why he wants to take total control. The Holy Spirit knows why he wants to take total control so that it does not leave any space for any other spirit to also, to also enter into it, to mix up with anything. No. But a lot of believers, we ourselves, we oppose the Holy Spirit from taking total control. This is a problem. We, are, we, we, we ourselves, we block the Holy Spirit from taking total control. When an evil spirit gains access to the vessel, a human being, that evil spirit wants to take total control because it does not want anything else coming in. This is it. This is the nature of spirit. When they get into their spirit, they want to take total control. They want to dominate. It's very important. It's very important. Anybody you see who fights against truth, who restrains truth, who blocks truth, has a problem, and it's spiritual. To become an agent of truth, it will not happen when you cannot receive truth. 